Hello Stampers, Kelly Atchison at stampabove.com coming to you from a very snowy Menasha, Wisconsin today. I have a little tip that I wanted to share with you and I kind of fell upon this tip by accident um, this morning as I was kind of thinking, getting ready for my stamp clubs that are going on. So when I get thinlets, um, I haven't done it in a while, but once in a while I will take them to my team meetings and let my gals cut out the images and mount them on a piece of cardstock so even if they don't have the thinlets, they can still show their customers. And while I was doing this this morning and preparing for my stamp club so that my customers can see what the die cuts actually look like that we'll be using tonight, I thought, you know, this is just a really good thing for anybody to do, not just demonstrators, so I decided to share it with you. So what I've got here is the Celebrate You Thinlets. This is a free product you can get during celebration with your $100 order. And it's got Celebrate You and Amazing in it. And what I did is I took a piece of black cardstock and die cut the dies in Lemon Lime Twist and mounted it on this piece of cardstock. I then put it in the folder that holds my dies so that when I take these to classes, I can pop this out and my customers can see what the dies actually look like. And the reason why I thought this would be a good idea for anybody to do, as you know, things race through my head, um, is because lots of times, not so much this one, because I know there's three butterflies in here, but when I'm looking or trying to design a card and I'm trying to decide on what I'm gonna use for it, it's nice to be able to see what the dies are cutting, right? This is what they're gonna look like in my package, so it's like, oh, you really can't see that very good. But even more importantly is some of the dies that have more die cuts in them. There's a lot going on in here, and maybe I'm looking for something that's gonna do some little polka dots for me, and this really kind of brings it home. Look at all the elements. This is the mini treat bag thinlets all the elements in here and not only can I get a strip of polka dots and hearts and stars but you can also get the stars of the hearts and well I didn't do the little polka dots but you can also get all those elements to use in your creations too. So I just thought I'd share that with you. Um, it's just an easier way especially with these bigger dies sets that have a whole bunch of stuff in them for you to kind of go oh there's some stars I'll use those or oh look at this little torn tag deal. So just a little tip, and then I thought, well, as long as I'm doing that, I'd share with you how I store my embossing folders and my framelits or dies. Now, these are all my embossing folders over here, and then I've got all my dies over here. You can see that it's kind of bulging and overflowing a little bit. These are all just current product. I don't have any retired stuff in here. I got these um, bins at Target, and I just like to watch for cute little bins. These kind of match my room, so that's why they caught my eye. And then see what I can do with them, and this is what I this is what I came up with. Now, I think I'm going to ask my husband, or maybe I will myself, if I can get some time, to build me a little um, a box, a wooden box. I saw some online. There are some companies that build stuff for stampers, and while their stuff is beautiful. And if you can't make your own, it's a great option, but a box about this size, a wooden box to put my dies in was like $40 and I just can't justify that. I have stamps to buy people. <laughs> so $40 for a wooden box doesn't work for me and I do know how to do woodworking. So, um, but like I said, if you don't have that option or know somebody that can make you one, it's a great option to be able to purchase some of these things online for storage purposes. And then, I've been getting a lot of questions and I appreciate your questions. I love that people are asking me questions. Lots of questions and comments under my videos. Um, so I just wanted to clarify a few things. Some of the questions, well most of the questions are related to celebration. Um, celebration is the most wonderful time of the year. You've heard me say this, but it is where when, for every $50 you order, you get to choose a free item out of here. So I just wanna let you know, lots of questions are, um, do you have to only purchase out of this occasion's mini catalog to qualify for celebration? Oh no, absolutely not. You can order from either one of our catalogs, and even better yet, when you go to my online store in the left-hand column, you can go to the clearance rack and you can buy stuff off of there that also 
qualifies to get a free item out of here. So anything you buy from Stampin' Up as a customer will qualify you to get a free item out of here. Then the other thing I've been getting a lot of questions on, when you join, people are asking me, now I call this our discount starter kit because I have a fairly large team and the majority of my team members are discount shoppers or what Stampin' Up! demonstrators like to call hobbyists. I choose discount shoppers. Why? Because they ordered this kit so they can continue to get a discount on the products they're ordering. It's a discount shopper, right? So what exactly is my discount shopper? It's the person who orders the kit. You get to choose $125 in product for only $99. No shipping charges either. Plus, be, um, between now and March 31st, you get to add two additional free stamp sets. And we have some pretty big stamp sets in our catalogs. That can be up to $101 value if you choose the largest ones. So you're looking at $226 in product of your choice. You get whatever you want in your discount starter kit for only $99 plus tax. There's no shipping on any of this. Shipping on $226 would cost you $22.60 if I did my math right. <laughs> that was hard. Um, so it's a huge saving. So if you're thinking about placing a big order, you may want to consider buying the discount starter kit. How do you, so what happens with the discount starter kit? Um, you don't want to sell anything. That's fine. Um, you don't want to buy anything else? No, well, that's okay too. There's no penalty. Although I think you'll really enjoy being on my team. I do um, Facebook Live meetings so that no matter where you're located in the United States, you can always be present for the meeting. I give away door prizes for everybody watching live. Plus those meetings are posted to my Facebook group where you can watch them anytime. So you don't have to be um, watching at the same time that I'm doing a meeting. I also have um, a private Facebook group for my team. I have a private Facebook blog and I'm available to help with just about anything that my stampers need. One of the questions that I get a lot is if you order the discount shopper kit, can you get the celebration items? So you're going to be spending $99. No, you cannot order any celebration items with the kit, but you get $226 worth the product of your choice for $99 with no shipping. Okay, that's huge. Then you can go on to the website under your discount shopper status and you can order whatever you want at a 20% discount. So then you can get your celebration items. And right now, if you just want to place an order, if your order reaches $250, you get 10%. So $25 in Stampin' Rewards to spend on anything you want, plus an additional $25 till the end of March. So we've got a promotion with shopping, free items. We've got a promotion when you buy the discount shopper kit. And also, when you place a large order or have a party, you get an additional $25. The other thing that I wanted to tell you I'm getting a lot of questions about is we have two different levels in the celebration brochure. The first one is with every $50 you get to choose an item. That's a level one. Level two is with every $100 you get to choose an item. And you will find the $50 on each picture in here until you get to the end back here where you will see the $100. This is our level two. So when you place a $100 order, you can get these framelits. And of course, you know, it requires more because framelits are more expensive. But I think you're gonna love these. I do have a video coming up using the framelits um, and I believe Brusho Crystal Color that you're going to love. So watch for that. This is also a level two the happy wishes because you've got, this is so big it comes in two cases. So you've got 16 different rubber stamps here. So please do always feel free to leave questions under my YouTube video. You can also email me at kelly at stampabove.com if you'd like any further information. You'll find on my blog in the um, right hand column, if you go down far enough, you're gonna find a category that says $99 kit. If you click on that, it'll take you to a page where there's a bunch of question and answers there so you can pretty much get all your questions answered about the discount shopper kit. 
If you have any others, leave me a message on YouTube, email me, kelly at stampabove.com. Always willing to answer your questions. I appreciate them. And see if you can't take a, take a little time and do this with your dies so that when you're going through these, you can see better what you might need. You guys have a fabulous week. Don't forget to click down here on my subscribe button so you'll be subscribed to my YouTube channel. You don't want to miss anything I have coming up. And I hope you have a wonderful week. Bye-bye.